While celebrating successes, but still promising more change. Today, Baltimore City leaders gathered to give an update on what's going on behind the scenes at the police department. 11 News I team reporter Lisa Robinson is live at City Police Headquarters tonight. Lisa. Well, Donna, that strategic plan is the commissioner's Bible for change, and he says so far it's helped him make a number of improvements over the last year. In the last year, we've moved to better listen to our employees and infuse their voices in correcting internal issues within our police department. We've worked to modernize our systems and created accountability in every area of the department. Police Commissioner Anthony Batts says reforms within the department are ongoing, but right now they're at the halfway point. And he says the community is responding. For example, there's been a 300% increase in the number of people calling Metro Crime Stoppers with tips. The commissioner says there's much more to be done. In January, the department will change the way it assigns officers. Where the crime is at the time, we're putting officers there. At the same, at the same time, going to a 410 schedule allows the officers to have uh, more resources out there so we can get them out of those cars. We can get them uh, on the hunt for uh, offenders that are out there make us more proactive in building the time to make that happen. To date, there have been 200 homicides this year compared to 218 this time last year. Bats also points to the reduction in complaints as a measure of progress. Discourtesy complaints to internal affairs went from 184 in 2012 to 86 in 2014. Notice of claims to sue the city went from 161 in 2012 to 55 in 2014. And excessive force complaints went from 122 in 2012 to 66 in 2014. What you're seeing reflected in the numbers that we're talking about today is a focus on training, uh, a focus on uh, the types of community policing that will allow us not just to see a reduction in violence, but an improvement in the city as well. And that's a, uh, the, a, a big part of it for me. Is that, yes, we're and a big part of it for the commissioner, he says changing his command staff was huge. Reporting live downtown, Baltimore, Lisa Robinson, WBAL-TV 11 News.